always a very special time sunset both just in the sort of the aesthetics of it obviously just the beauty of it beauty of it but also the feeling you get as a human I think we've been looking at sunsets for millennia and uh, maybe just to cause a lot of fear in us these days we're not that worried about the dark anymore it often just inspires a feeling of sort of great emotion of awe and happiness and beauty and those are fantastic things to feel another area that I find really beautiful and might be tricky to look at it but James just all those little hills in the foreground or shall I say in the distant foreground just get all these slight different layers and use of color in there there's lots of mist floating around in there still showing that there's lots of moisture towards the mountains and it's just a great sense of mystery ever since I was a little kid I've loved the distant mountains the blues the colors they make and they're just the promise of exploration maybe even a little bit of magic in there really is gorgeous out here. Everything from the trees in the foreground, the clouds. What a stunning wild earth we live on. We're going to just try a little bit again, just change our perspective slightly. I spent another few minutes showing you a slightly different angle in the sunset. that view those little copies it's just very very beautiful just that whole area there I think this is one of the most beautiful ways I've seen those hills in it's just lots of low hills or what we call copies in the foreground little buttresses almost and behind them just the different ridges all the way to the to the, to the escarpment Still quite warm out here, but the temperature just dropping a few degrees. You hear a crested barbet calling in the background, a few crickets are starting to call. I'm sure right at this moment, right now, there's lions and leopard out there busy stretching, getting their muscles loose, hyenas getting out of a lot of your diurnal animals getting ready for the night. Through all of this, the earth is turning, the mountains steady, and because of that movement, we see the sun setting. I hope you forgive me some of my trying to but I would have loved to have shaped it this really well. But it is fun to try and just maybe add a little bit more understanding into this amazing environment around us. Everything from those hills to the Legray Solar, and just passing land out, fix path before the sun down. Fortunately, the light is very low now, so you can't make out all the brilliant colors that these birds are so well known for. It's fun up there. Fantastic. You can easily understand why people had to, as they evolved along the route of ice, why things like poetry and art and expression had to develop. You can't have all these different stimuli around, all these amazing things, and all this amazing nature, and not want to have some deeper appreciation of it, something beyond the science something deeper than the research you can see why people become inspired for that kind of stuff so let's try and get these big trees in the foreground I don't know which other way to look at it it's just 
all very beautiful. Big knobstone trees. Often look at these trees when you drive past here. Some lush grass underneath it. Often have impala and zebra grazing here. Still that magnificent backdrop of the sun setting. Actually the aftermath of the sun setting. The sun's already set. It's now just catching the last light. amazing planet we live on. So the museum saying power is back up so we should be able to do the drive without problem. I also to think that there's a sunset 24 hours a day somewhere in the world. Any time in the world. And sunrise is 24 hours a day. Depending on where you are right now. Some of you might look at the sun, it's still many hours away, but it's good to stop and look at it. Some days it's more inspirational, days like this, you can almost get lost in that sunset, but it's a magic part of the day. It's happening all the time. We're going to drive on a little bit. Before I get myself into a dangerous position of starting to, starting to sound a little bit syrupy, let me do this. Time of the day since I was a kid, the sunset time in the bush was so powerful. It's a very inspirational time. There's a, there literally is magic around, and uh, yeah, it's a very special place, very time to special time to share. Drive around a little bit, see what else we can find. It's almost, I'd say, five or ten minutes from now. We're going to have to go to infrared. But in the meantime, this is the time when a lot of your nocturnal animals start walking around. All those animals with the soft padded feet ready for the night. Hopefully we can find one of them.